fuck at you when you down. Motivation, all the hating that they doing, that shit motivation. Staying winning, nothing less, ain't no consolation. Used to tell me that I couldn't, that's my motivation. Coach Jordan here at Strike One Baseball Academy. Today we're going to go over our top three lifts to improve your game that you could add to your workout sport. Let's get it. So to start, we're going to go with our deadlift. Our deadlift is going to be our main lift. There are three different types of deadlifts that we could use, but today we're going to stick with our hex bar deadlift, right? Along with that, you also have a close stance deadlift and a wide stance deadlift, but we're going to focus on hex bar, mainly because it's great for beginners and because it works out great and you can stick with it through the rest of your career. What's unique about the deadlift is that it targets your entire body. It could work every single muscle in your body in one lift. Along with that, it's a great way to build strength and explosiveness. So let's get into it. So to start, we're gonna put our feet about shoulder length apart. We don't wanna to be too close, but we don't wanna to be too wide, and shoulder length is perfect. Once you have your feet set, you're gonna come down. Remember, it's a hinge, it's not a squat. So you wanna put your butt back, you don't wanna put your butt down. So once you're down, you wanna grab the bar, you wanna put your middle finger in line with the rest of where the weight goes. Once you have that, you wanna drop your butt just a little bit, and you're gonna stand straight up with your chest up the entire time, keeping your butt sticked out. You're gonna stand up, proud chest, gonna hold it and then you're gonna slowly go in reverse down. So up next for our second lift we're gonna have a front squat. The front squat is great because it allows you to build strength, you become a better base runner, a better fielder to make those long throws, and a better hitter to hit the ball a lot farther. I prefer the front squat because it forces the lifter to maintain a more upright torso and a tighter lower back. The front squat also places the shoulders in a more joint friendly position. So for our third lift we're gonna be doing a landmine press with rotation but we're gonna add a clean into it. So to do this, rotation is the name of the game in baseball. In every aspect of the game, you've got to have great rotational strength. The landmine lifts are great for all athletes. It focuses on core strength, rotational strength, and full body development. So to start, we're going to put our midline on the inner end cap. We're going to come down with our left hand. We're going to grab it right where I need it. All my weight is on my back leg right now. So once we go, we're going to bring it up. Once we're here, we're going to hitch, switch arms, and push, right? All my strength, I'm set into my back leg. My left leg does not have that much power into it, right? It's not a lot of pressure, it's not a lot of weight. Everything is in my back leg. But when we're coming from, from this position, pushing it up, you gotta be quick with it, right? You gotta stabilize your core and you gotta be strong. Yeah, the hate, the grind, the sweat, the blood, the time, my motivation. Ay, I work too hard, too long, and I be in the conversation. 